Today we're going to be talking about how to climb quickly in ranked solo queue. Now as a disclaimer, if all you want to do is play some champion that you like, then you go ahead and do that. If you're that guy that loves Tarek, feel free to spam a thousand games on Tarek, and do not worry about your rank. On the other hand, if you're actually trying to climb in ranked solo queue, then it's time to take a look at your current champion pool and be really honest with yourself. What you need to accept is that your kill death ratio, your CS, and gold do not matter at all. The only stat that really matters is your win rate, and you want a decent sample size of at least 15 to 20 games to gauge your skill level on a given champion. You want to be playing champions that you perform well on, and this means that if you cannot win more than 50% of your games on a given champion, then it is time to let that champion go. I do not care how good you think you are, you need to realize that picking this champion is extremely counterproductive. Moving beyond that, if you're able to win 50-55% to of your games on a given champion, you will climb very slowly. You will be winning 5 out of every 10 games on average, which will make you feel like you're not making any progress at all, not to mention that you may need multiple attempts at promos before you get through. Going further, if you're able to win 55-60% to of your games on a given champion, then your in-game experience is noticeably better, and it will not feel like a painful grind. You will be winning 6 out of every 10 games on average, which is just barely enough to feel like you're making consistent progress. Going beyond that, if you're really good at a particular champion, you'll be able to win 60-70% to of your games, and at this point you've entered the zone where you're winning 2 out of every 3 games on average, and promos will go by very quickly and you can expect to hit the next tier in less than 100 games. At the extreme end, if you're able to maintain a 70% or a higher win rate on a given champion, then it means that your skill level on this champion is well beyond the current MMR range you are playing in, and you will climb extremely quickly. So when you go back into rank solo queue, do not be that guy that says Phil. Always ask for the roles that allow you to play your best champions. The results of playing your best champion will always be visible in your match history. Here is an example with the same player on two different accounts. What we have here is someone who performs extremely well on Jarvan. On one account, he's picking his best champion whenever he can, which allows him to climb quickly to Diamond. On the other account, he's performing extremely poorly on every single champion that is not Jarvan. The moral of this match history here is always, always, always request your best roles and champions in ranked solo queue. If you found this video helpful, do subscribe to the channel, follow on Twitter, and leave a comment about what kind of content you would like to see in future videos. Do check out the video links on either side for more gameplay tips and strategies in this channel.